A few weeks ago after a long off season, Derek Rose came out and said something that turned a lot of heads or raised a lot of cocks. What did he, say? he basically showed up to a press conference with his shirt off showing off his like off season body and he claimed that he felt 100% healthy. And he also said something along the lines of I feel as good as I did in my rookie season and after hearing that no Derek Rose fan could stand up safely. I got a boner. So instead of recognizing that he's a 34 year old vet with glass knees, I, I decided to take it way too little. Literally, I present to you for the first time since he was relevant in like 2012 or 13 or 14 or something around that time. Derek Pooh, not that Pooh, Rose, six foot two. 95 overall with 29 badges. So yeah, this is what Derrick Rose would look like if his statements were true. And with this team, I fully believe that they're a deep playoff team. RJ Barrett, Jalen Brunson, the new addition, Julius Randle, who's an all-star. Well, obviously not very good last year, but he was an all-star. Now I know what you're thinking. If he's 34 years old, then he's just going to regress and he's just going to be trash in a few seasons. Like that is going to be pointless and everything, but no. I changed his peak from like 34 or 35, whatever it was, to 38. I'm actually, I'm going to change it to 40. We're going to see like a full six years or whatever of prime Derrick Rose and we'll see what he can do with this godforsaken Knicks team, which if you've seen any of my previous videos, you'd know that uh, 2K just hates them. All right, in Derrick's first game, they lose by like 36 points. Yeah, 36 points. Hyas Jones rips the Knicks another hole with 39 points. Derrick Rose on the other hand, there we go. Imagine if he came out in real life and did that. Everyone would go f bananas. 31 points, 1 rebound, 4 assists, 2 steals. Hey, those are good Derrick Rose numbers. All right, it's the all-star break. This is like a big moment of truth. I'm, I'm sure he'll make it, but uh, stop. Um, You are kidding me. You have got to be joking. He's not an all-star. How do you average like 20? What, what? What? How many points? Oh, he's injured. Oh, that makes sense. Look, I turn on injuries because it makes it realistic and unpredictable and stuff, but I might need to reconsider. So for all of you as pissed as me right now, bop. I feel like 2K's realism goes a little bit too far sometimes. Luka Doncic, MVP, averaging Luka numbers. I'm not even surprised at this point. Most improved goes to Trey Jones. From 6 to 8.8 .8 points, and you're not going to give Derrick Rose his respect. This mother goes from averaging 12 points per game to 25 and you don't give it to him. So disrespectful! A bigger boy. He doesn't make an all-NBA team, no defensive team, and the Knicks aren't even in the play-in, so year one is a complete L. The Pelicans win with Zion Williamson winning finals MVP with his skinny ass. LeBron James and Carmelo Anthony retire, but one GOAT retires, one GOAT, well, one future GOAT is about to join the league. Victor Wembanyama, I hope I pronounced that right, is getting drafted this year. I don't remember who won the lottery, but uh, the Phoenix Suns Oh, Scoot's good, but I'm not passing on Victor. Victor goes to the Detroit Pistons to join Cade. And what about the Knicks? Uh, they picked up Derek Lively. I've actually heard of that name. He's a seven foot one center, so he could be a good pairing with Derek. But I guess we'll see. Derek's now a 93, so he did regress just a little bit. But maybe that's also because he was injured, so I doubt he's actually regressing. He jumps from 29 badges to 37, and the Knicks stay pretty solid. RJ Barrett jumps to an 87 overall. Bronny James gets drafted next year, so that'll be pretty cool, but... But uh, let's get right into it. What happens in the first game? Derrick Rose, 27 and 13, MVP statistics. And Darius Baisley joins the team and he scores 26 in his first game. What about the Rook? Nine points, five rebounds, four for five. Great shooting, actually. It's the second all-star draft. If he gets selected, you guys need to like and subscribe. Uh, let's let's see. Uh, Yeah, you guys know what to do. Luka Doncic, another MVP, quite similar numbers to last year. And Victor Wembanyama, Rookie of the Year, averaging 24, 10, an average three blocks per game. So as LeBron James said, dude is an alien. Tyler Hero, most improved player, averaging 27. And ever since breaking up with Katya Elise Henry, he's just been absolutely off his chops. <laughs> The Bicker Boy, another coach of the year. And we see Derek Rose make an all-NBA second team, as he should. He averaged 25 and 10, which is honestly better than his MVP season. Well, yeah, 2011, he averaged 25 and 7. So, yes, better. Why I say better like that, it's better. Better. The Knicks are the three seed, and we're going up against the Indiana Pacers, who have uh, pretty much the same team. Harris Halliburton is now a hooper hooper. He's an 88 overall. But just look at our team, dude. 
We're, we're winning. Game one's a dub. Game two is a loss. Game three is also a loss. Game four, we win. Game five is ours. Game six is a win. So if we win this one, then uh, we, we're through to the next round, which we do. And this is what we want. Derrick Rose is making moves. This round, we're going up against the Boston Celtics. Boston have, wow, Jason Tatum improved to a 96. Jalen Brown an 88. They've still got a very solid team. But honestly, I mess with ours just as much. Game one, W. Game two, also a W. Game three, we lose. Game four is an L. Let's not blow this. They're up by one in the series. Why did I go... What? But who uses Gamecast Live? Actually, not gonna lie. I've used it once or twice. Derrick Rose, get on your bike. Let's score some buckets. They're up by 13. One and a half minutes left. This is an L. And yes, we lose by eight points. Derrick Rose, fantastic game. RJ, fantastic game. Did we just... Where did we take our losses? Uh, some people on their team must have just balled out. Yes, Jason Tatum, 33 points. Three rebounds, four assists, three steals. Their stars combined for what? What's that? 65 points and Thomas Bryant's now on the team and he also scored 23 and the Boston Celtics take the championship so I'm not too mad the eventual champions beat us and Derek gets better by one overall as well as RJ who actually gets better by two Derek Rose another all-star but you could have guessed that he's now a six-time all-star in his career oh and did I see RJ Barrett yes I saw RJ Barrett who's also an all-star and for the first time since Derek Rose was born the Knicks have 100% fan interest did Derek win any awards no by the way no all NBA appearance for our boy which is kind of weird if you ask me um he averages 25 and 11 so even better than last year so maybe guys just got better or 2k are just ages because you know he's he's 36 years old oh but we are the number one seed who are we facing in the first round the charlotte hornets i don't even really need to look at their team they can get out of here but they got the mellow ball and uh leonard miller get swept get swept we get, they just got swept and the knicks and the pacers are in the second round that have tyrese halliburton yeah anyone else desmond bain one of my mates actually said desmond bain is going to be the best shooting guard in the league by the end of the year so what do you guys think about that don't be afraid to roast him in the comments if that was a bad take i, I i'm not sure how i stand with that i mean he might jump to top five but i don't know about number one um we're down three one so i'm gonna sim cast the rest of the series oh but uh, never mind, we won that game. You ever so concentrated on talking that you miss what you're talking about? Yeah, that's like a daily occurrence for me. Uh, Derek Rose, 28 and 10. But we need to win every game from now on. Uh, one and a half minutes left. We're up by one. I'm definitely going to jump in. All right, there we go. Pass it in. Derek Rose is on the floor. Let's get like a crazy dunk from you. What are you doing, RJ? RJ is going to hit it though. Honestly, I shouldn't be mad. RJ can hit that. He's a 90 overall now. But on the other end, this dude called Smith pulls up, misses. We get the rebound. Derek Rose with the ball. Just take it all the way, please. In and out, crossover or something. RJ Barrett pull up midi and he hits it. And yeah, with 30 seconds left, it looks like we're going to win this game. But wow, I always just talk too soon, don't I? Uh, five points with 21 seconds left. They're going to foul. If we hit both and it's wraps, uh, we do hit both. So yeah, on to the next one. We're up going into the second half narrowly, but we just ran away with it in the fourth. Derek Rose, 33 points, 13 rebounds, seven goddamn steals. And then RJ with 31. This is a real dynamic duo. Very very tough series, but we are in the Eastern Conference Finals against the Orlando Magic. Who is it? Paolo? Yeah, Paolo Vucevic is back. And well, I guess Franz Wagner is the greatest player on that team. They can get out of our faces. We, this is a win. 100%. Look, you just got to have faith and you, anything is possible. So the NBA Finals sees the New York Knicks versus the New Orleans Pelicans. And wow, uh, their team just seems to have fallen apart. Uh, we win game one. We win game two. Can Derek be a champion? Uh, I, I always speak too soon, but no, uh, they're coming back. They came right back. And wow, it's a six-point game with 10 minutes left. Uh, can we come back? It's a very close game. Oh my god. I almost skipped past absolutely everything. They have the ball with 17 seconds left. Derek Rose, let's see what you're made of. Derek's getting uh, defending DJ Wagner or Wagner or Wagner. And it looks like they're going to get Zion the ball in the paint. They do. Oh, but he almost gets it ripped. He gets it ripped by uh, Derek Lively. Pass up. What is got? Oh, I forgot that there was like no time left. He's Okay, he puts it up and we're going to overtime. God damn it, I'm goofy. How did I miss the situation that we were in? There's 30 seconds left of overtime. It's still a tight game. Uh, they're going to pass it into Zion. Zion's got prime position. He dunks it. Oh my God, and one. So if Zion hits this, we need a three to tie it. Mitch has the ball on the sideline. He passes it into Bronson, who passes it to D-Rose. Can we get a bit of movement? Jalen Bronson, wide open. 
three, hits it, and it's a tied game, exactly what we needed. Why did they leave him open? Up, uh, Brandon Ingram? I thought Brandon Ingram wasn't on the team anymore. Uh, he's an 88. Why, why wasn't he starting? There are no injuries or anything, so I don't know. Also, Dustin Daniels. But the Pels have another opportunity to put it up. Are they going to run it right to the end? I'm sure they will. Uh, DJ Wagner or Wagner or Wagner. Uh, pass to Zion. Zion puts it up. Four seconds left, and he hits it. All right, they don't have a timeout. They just got to dribble it up. Derek pulls it. Half court and misses. Oh, we got eliminated. That is a bit frustrating. Look, look how Derek is right now. That's kind of like I am on my seat. But the Pelicans are going to win the NBA championship and will Zion win the MVP? And by golly, he does. RJ drops 35, 6, and 3, while Derek 29 and 13. Look, these two ball out consistently, even though they weren't efficient this game still. Once again, I am liking this. Everyone gets better and uh, Derek Rose is ecstatic. Derek now a seven-time All-Star. RJ did you make it? Yes, RJ Barrett also makes the cut on Team Luca. But someone please tell me why we are stanky ass booty cheeks. Uh, we win two in a row, but still. Uh... Oh my god. Not in a million years. Ben Simmons wins MVP. The Knicks were the seventh seed, so we're in the plan. Please win this game. Yes, we do. And we're facing the Brooklyn Nets in the first round. Brooklyn, who do you got? Oh, of course. The MVP, Ben Simmons, Kevin Durant, Andre Drummond. Oh, who, by the way, is a lethal three-point shooter now. If you don't watch Chicago Bulls games, you should definitely watch it. It's primetime TV. And really just because of Andre Drummond. How we were the seventh seed, I've got no idea. Let's let's just kick these. Um, I was in the middle of saying let's kick these guys asses but they're up 3-1 that's a tie game with one minute and 20 seconds left so I'm, I'm gonna jump in mvp ben simmons on mvp derrick rose what could be better oh my god but derrick how can you fire back you spin on ben simmons step back kind of no nope, uh, uh but you're gonna lay it up and it's gonna miss and that yeah yeah great play and even better commentary um they just hit a three in our face vince carter trying to act cool but uh that yeah they're up by five. Oh, but emmanuel's open and he's gonna hit it but this man thompson is a menace what are you gonna do you put up a layup and it's in wow he is tough who is this guy is he a real player um orsa thompson he's got uh 36 points drafted in 2023-24 yeah he's a real person Wow, and Vince is f***ing ecstatic. Vince acting like a little girl whose mom says, let's go to McDonald's. We're now down by five with 20 seconds left. We just got to put up a shot. Let's get it in Derek's hands, but uh, wow, what? Okay, first of all, RJ gets a charging foul, but second of all, where's Derek Rose? There he is on the bench, but why is he not in the game? Okay, if Ben hits at least one of these and it's wraps, yeah, game over. But Derek, why weren't you in the game? And you were having a great game up to that point. Same with RJ. But this year we get kicked out and time is running out. It's it's Jar versus the Cavs in the finals. What's going to happen? Oh, wow. Wow, the Cavs won. And Evan Mobley finals MVP. And wow, Derrick Rose finds a way to get better. He's a 97 overall. In fact, everyone else also getting better. It's only a matter of time. I'm telling you guys. Hey, if you're still watching the video, comment poo down below. And I'm not in control of how you spell it. Just just do it for Derrick Rose's sake. Derrick Rose an all-star once again. I didn't even need to tell you guys. And RJ Barrett also an all-star. Nikola Jokic now an MVP. Derrick Rose still hasn't won MVP. You're so dumb. But honestly, that's probably because he doesn't get triple doubles and stuff like that, but he's still a baller. Bug, 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 bug. Um, LeBron James. Why don't they just call him Bronny? Or at least LeBron James Jr. Like, that shit is, that shit confused the hell out of me. And Derek, another year, no All-NBA team. The Knicks are the sixth seed, and we're going up against the Detroit Pistons, who have uh, Victor Wembanyama and Cade Cunningham. This team is so good, I wouldn't be surprised if they won. Let's, let's just see what happens. Oh my god, I I, I, what is wrong with me? They went to a game seven and, uh, well, they won by five points. But yeah, another year, no NBA finals. And it's Shea versus Cade Cunningham and Victor Wembanyama in the NBA finals. Wow, that was extremely quick. Shea wins finals MVP. Was Josh Giddy in that playing? Uh, Miles Bridges played. Don't know if we're ever going to say that again. Uh, LeBron James Jr. also, why did I call him that? Bronny James also on the team. Chet Holmgren, wow, yeah, this team is stacked. Josh Giddy, is that Mikey Williams? Williams, Mikey Williams as well. The OKC Thunder always end up being leagues above anyone else. Uh, Kevin Durant retires, James Harden, Steph Curry. They will be missed. Draymond Green, uh, I don't know. Let's see, did Derek regress? He, he very well could have. And yeah, he gets worse by one overall. So he went from a 97 to a 96. Derek Rose, a nine-time All-Star, despite regressing a little bit. I guess it doesn't really matter. He's a 96. DJ Wagner now an MVP. So he was an 81 overall a couple years ago. But now he's a 96. Six, averaging 
6 and 11. Looks a little bit like Derek Rose to me. Derek, did you make any teams or anything? Nah, I, I am kidding myself. But the Knicks are the fourth seed. So yeah, not too bad. Our team stays cool and we're facing Scotty Barnes's Toronto Raptors. They win game one. We win game two. They win game three. What am I doing? We win game four. We win game five. Can we advance? Yes, we do. We're facing the Atlanta Hawks in the second round. They still got Trey, John Collins, you know, the old gig. Game one, dub. Game two, dub. Game three, L. Game four, dub. Game five, dub. And boy, oh boy, Eastern Conference Finals. Let's see, who are we facing? My God, I, I, I hate this. The Detroit Pistons always seem to dismantle us. We win game one. We win game two. No way. We win game three. Oh, I thought we were going to sweep them. I was I was about to get very excited. Well, let's see. Let's not blow it. Uh, we, we Did we get past? Yes, we did. And so we're facing Shea. No, not Shea's. Cameron Whitmore's OKC Thunder. Josh Gideon, 92. LeBron James Jr. Why? Bronny James James Jr. 91 and then Chet Holmgren's also a 90. So yeah, we should say our prayers, tell our family we love them because we're about to get absolutely fucked. And yes, they are the NBA champions, LeBron James Jr. <gasps> Bronny James. Yes, Bronny James finals MVP. And yeah, we did take two games from them, but I was confident enough that they were going to win that I just didn't jump into any games. But at the age of 39, Derrick Rose is still very much in this bitch. But still no NBA championship for Derrick Rose and time is running out. Derrick Rose is an all-star starter this year. Now, Ja Moran an MVP. We're getting some variety here. And my God, Bryce James has made the league and he's the most improved player. Whoever made this roster putting some respect on his name. He's six foot six he's a small forward power forward if you guys want to see a bryce james career simulation i'm i'm absolutely down he's been a hot topic recently with his like his growth spurt and stuff so yeah i think that'd be pretty cool the knicks are the three seed and we're going against detroit again they've got pretty much the same team as last time we saw them so uh i'm pretty sure we came out on top last time yeah i think we almost swept them uh we're up by 3-1 can we make it to the next round easily no we don't and they've brought it to a game seven so uh let's reset these rosters and they're up going into the fourth uh and it's not really close they're up by like 10 uh yeah they beat us Derek rose where are you he wow oh my god 34 minutes eight points four rebounds six assists Derek, are you falling off my boy no he averaged 23 well almost 24 points in the playoffs so he's not falling off he just had a bad game and it was just the worst time to have a bad game bronny james finals mvp and yeah that they're, they're a dynasty at this point oh and just like that Derek rose retires he's still 96 at the age of four but uh, rules are rules. Not that I made any rules, but he, he retired. Let's leave it at that. Is he a Hall of Fame inductee? Yes, of course he is. He averages 20 points, 7 rebounds, 1.3 steals, and he's still a one-time MVP. Didn't win an MVP while we were simulating, but he was a multiple-time All-Star. Um, Didn't win a championship. Obviously, wasn't a Finals MVP, but he did make an All-NBA second team in the time that we were, you know, doing, doing our stuff, and he made it to the Finals once, which he went to a Game 7, but just couldn't close close it out in the fourth quarter so yeah it was good to relive it but it was a bit sad that he didn't win an nba championship but i mean that's an extremely hard thing to do let's see where he placed all time in different stats was he in the points he was 34th in points and there were a few years in his career where he wasn't like a prolific scorer so this is pretty good 22nd in field goals he probably wouldn't be in threes uh but i i stand corrected he was 89th assists he's got to be there he averaged like nine assists some years maybe even 10 so we'll see and yes derrick rose was 16 all time just above Kyrie Irving also above one time MVP Ben Simmons I, I honestly still can't believe that happened um let's see who retires his jersey uh just the New York Knicks so not even the Chicago Bulls retired his jersey that's kind of sad but anyway if you guys like the video please like and subscribe we're trying to reach 10,000 subscribers by the end of the year and if you do like and subscribe you'll get a lifetime supply of V-Bucks so I'll see you guys next video adios